Sir, there's been another incident. What? Incidents are my least favorite thing right now. Ray has escaped us again. He's no longer even in the asylum. All right, this isn't working. We'll need to take a different approach. Something deadlier. Ha! Ah, I've got it! Uh, um, guys? Uh, fe fellow patients? I guess I'm alone then. In the wilderness. Finally, the beacon of civilization. Newsflash, a lunatic has just escaped from the Morrow Hill Mental Institution. He is considered armed and dangerous. The body of his girlfriend was discovered in their shared apartment earlier today. If you see this man, do not approach him. Report him to the authorities. Please call the authorities before posting about this on social media. What? Arlene's dead? But I didn't kill her! What's going on? I, I gotta get back and see if she's all right. A dramatic manhunt is going on in the downtown core with air support from police helicopters involved in the search. We're assured that the suspect will be in custody very shortly. Further updates as the situation develops. Dude, yes, you are on the TV! Oh, wait till I tell him about this on Facebook, bro. Oh, check it out, dude. I think I'll go to blast the booze nap first, though. Where's the rest of your body, bro? How can you blast your quads when you got no quads left, bro? <laughs> Okay, I think I know my way from here. If I take a right through the city outskirts, and then another right across the docks, and through downtown, I'll be home. Right, right, right. All the way to the right. Sometimes I find it frustrating that my vocal cords can only make a screeching, screaming sound. But then I think, man, there's so much nuance in each screech. So much art. I pour my soul into the subtle elements of a high-pitched scream. And in return, I give the world beauty. Such beauty. Also, I'm really good at aiming my poops at people's heads. What can I say? To be an artist is a calling. Oh, Fox, you won't leave me like all the others. You understand me. You understand that the only way to be truly happy is to be truly sad. Soon, soon we shall seal our sorrow with a kiss. A kiss not of joy, but of darkness. Leave Mr. Foxy alone, you creature of darkness! His soul is mine! Am I really celebrating my birthday alone on the docks again? Oh well, I suppose I'll just have to treat myself to another imaginary three-story tuna-filled fish cake with extra caviar. Attention, criminal citizen! I have you surrounded. There is no possible escape. I'll be moving in regular, predictable, circular search patterns to ensure that you cannot possibly escape. Yeah. 
Do you have the suspect in custody, Joe? You told me you'd do this, Joe. I I've got my job on the line here, buddy. You, you wouldn't let a friend down, would you? Hang in now, Ali. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Joe, he said it'd be fine to take out his ex, but oh my gosh, what are we gonna do? Where are we gonna go? I don't, I don't, I don't even know what she likes, so oh my gosh. How do, how do dates even work? Does she, does she like music? Or, or does she like dancing? Maybe she maybe she likes video games. I, I, I like video games, but, but, but I, I need to, I want to impress her, and, and I need to impress her. Oh my gosh. Ah. Attention citizen, you are entering a restricted area. Um, I'm just wanting to leave. No citizens, except for Donna Grandiosa, may pass through this checkpoint until the suspect is in custody. What suspect? He's wanted for escaping a mental institution and murder. Oh, um, well, uh, he, he sounds like he looks a lot different than I do. I appreciate the tip, citizen. Man, I just love authority. Oh, and working to enforce authority. And on my authority, nobody but Donna is getting through this roadblock. Yes! Hey, uh, can you take me to... Yeah, beat it, wise guy. You're all balled up. This here rides for the great Donna Grandiosa, and you don't sound nothing like her. Oh, but, but I, I didn't even talk to you yet. Well, you have now, you flat tire. I may be weak in the peepers, but I got the ears of an eagle, see? Your pipes ain't got nothing on hers. Now get a wiggle on, you ossified owl. You bore me. Did I marry the audiophile? This could be it. This could be where Donna Grandiosa is staying. <laughs> oh, to have her talk to me with that priceless mouth of hers. Donna, that'll result in a wonderful singing career and certainly won't result in them breaking your legs and your lips when they find out you can't pay up, Donna. Ah! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! The mob! That's how the mob takes back their mouth? I must admit, I'm... Surprise! I didn't know we had that technology. Well, looks like my opera career is over. I can now focus on my true love, mime. Plus, at least my diet will be more effective. Okay, okay, I can wake up some. I just pinch my. Don't put your dirty ashes in there. That's my baby's home. Get away from me, Joe. I've got a restraining order on you. 150 feet, Joe. There. That's 151. <sighs> Get a life, Joe. I've moved on, and you need to do the same, too. 
Maybe you should find someone to love more than you love stupid helicopters! I have! And you're dumping Ash into his home! What? Sorry! I can't hear you over the sound of how pretty my hair is going to be! Oh my gosh! Other people's emotional problems are so boring! Seriously, my hair is going to look fabulous. I am a sexy beast, and my date is one lucky gentleman. Damn! Alas, and woe too, for neither of these erstwhile parents cares for me truly at this moment. They care only for what I can do for them. She and he both care only for revenge on the other. I, it is a powerful motive, but not as powerful as love. If only the man's love could be proven true. For while it is still tainted by revenge on the lady, it is hollow, a mere farce unseen by its players. I still seek for myself a home where I can truly be happy. Cared for by someone untouched by baser motivations is a consummation devoutly to be wished. Ah, she's so frustrating. She's like a helicopter with a busted rotor turbine. And a new one can't be ordered for three weeks because of their stupid inventory management software. And by that I mean, ah, she's so frustrating. It's a giant... until he finds you! Testing! Testing! My hair! All that time, money, and hair product wasted! I'm so sick of having a mortal body, I swear to God! There we go! So fancy! So beautiful! This really feels surprisingly right! And now I die! I sleep, I swim, no more. No more must I suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous owners, but instead get eaten by a seagull. It has been a complicated day. Oh my god, oh my god, I am so full. If I even think of fish, I'll just... I'll just explode! Quick, think of something else. Think of... Uh, of rainbows! Yes! Uh, light as a rainbow floating over the ocean. Ocean full of fish! <laughs> oh no! No, no! Don't think of fish! Rainbows! Beautiful rainbows! Excuse me, I'm looking for my fish and I... Oh my gosh, that's him! You know that fish? He's my only true love and you stuffed him? And yet he's still alive! And what can I say? I'm a very good taxidermist. You're... you're wonderful. 
So talented, so... So beautiful, so... Awesome! You're like the best fish in the world! Only you're a human female! You're not so bad yourself, handsome. I never believed in love at first sight until this very second. Wow. Before, I thought the only way to be happy was to feel sad. But now I see that it's possible to be happy by feeling rad, too. Man! I love emotional breakthroughs that rhyme. I'm in love, and that's so great. I never have felt more complete. Improvising songs about how I feel is uh, actually pretty hard, but I can deal. This looks like that dead fox that Donna always wears. Although, come to think of it, I guess most dead foxes look pretty much the same. Hey, that's a great idea! We can go to the opera! That'll show her I'm a classy man who appreciates the finer things in life. Who, who like, like paying to have strangers sing at me. You've done it again, Ron. You are the man. You are the man who knows things you can do on a date sometimes. Uh, can you take me to... Oh, Donna, a pleasure as always. Your chariot awaits you. Uh, thanks for the ride. Finally home. I hope Eileen is back home and safe. said such terrible things on the news. Oh, thank goodness. Arlene, you're, you're here. Arlene, I... You got it, boss. Ar... Uh, 